what's good everyone today we're going to talk about how the most hyped up amateur boxer in the world named Kermel Moten might have the opportunity to make history by becoming the youngest world champion in the history of boxing and also the first boxer to ever have and potentially win a world title fight in his first professional fight now i know all you guys probably think this is crazy but recently floyd mayweather had an interview with fight hype and he had this to say what's the fighter name at 126 he's a uh, champion wood oh um the british dude yeah what's the name uh leewood leewood mm -hmm. um i got 126 pounds Mm. Um, that'd be a good match. No. Wait, hold on. Carmel Moten, the he's still an amateur, right? He's professional. Oh, he's turning pro. He's turning pro. Oh, he's turning pro. Yes. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's turning pro. Yes. Which means he hasn't turned pro yet. No. And, and you're saying that's a good matchup. Yes. That's a good matchup that's right a, now. Right now, I'm saying that's a good matchup. No, I know you guys might think this is absolutely ridiculous for someone to even think about getting a world title shot at their professional debut, but here are some of the accolades that Carmel Moten has. Carmel has been boxing his whole life, and at the age of just 17 years old, he already has 18 national championships as an amateur. He has been hyped up as Baby Tank, as people call him the next Gervonta Davis, and he has also been mentored and coached by Floyd Mayweather since he was a little kid. Where's the young fighters? Carmel, come on. Just, I, I, I truly believe this is going to be the next. I mean, it's so, it, we don't know who's going to be the next Floyd Mayweather, but I truly believe this could be the next Floyd Mayweather. Lay Wood did respond to Floyd Mayweather on Twitter, and it doesn't really seem like he is interested in fighting Carmel. However, if he did fight Carmel, it would be his biggest payday by far. So honestly, if I was him, I would take the fight as the whole world will definitely be watching. Now, Lay Wood is 35 years old and Carmel is only 17, which gives Lay the massive experience advantage and will make him the favorite for the fight. However, a fighter like Vasily Lomachenko, who is also an extremely hyped up amateur boxer with an amateur record of 396 and one with two Olympic gold medals. And although Loma was 24 when he turned pro, he won his first world title fight and just his third professional fight as a featherweight the same weight class that Carmel Melton currently is. Now I really hope this fight does happen as Carmel 100% passes the eye test on whether he's going to be a future star in boxing and with him being guided by Floyd Mayweather there's a great chance Carmel could be the next face of boxing. That's a title fight. Listen, we take chances to be great. Mm. All I'm saying is this, that's a good matchup. I'm not knocking the fighter, I'm not saying that Floyd has also guided and trained many boxers since they were young, such as Devin Haney, Gervonta Davis, and Shakur Stevenson, who are all world champions today. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys think this fight is actually going to happen, and if you guys think Carmel could actually beat Lay Wood, making him the youngest world champion in boxing history. My guy's 17. <laughs> that's my point. My he's... guy's 17. Oh man, that's... And he's destined to be great. Wow. He's destined to be great. Remember I told you that. Mm. 